With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello friends. The question says here, if angle A is equal to angle C, AB is equal to 6 cm, BB is 15 cm, AP is 12 cm and CP is 4 cm, then find the length of PD and CD. So here, what is given? AB is 6 cm here. Then BP 15 cm, AP 12 cm and then CP 4 cm. To solve this question, first of all, we will see that this angle APB and angle CPD both are equal because they are vertically opposite angles. So we will write here angle A P B is equal to angle C P D. Why? Vertically opposite angles. So when these two angles are equal and angle A is equal to angle C. Angle A is equal to angle C. It's given in the question. So what happens? These two triangles. Which two triangles? Angle triangle A B P is similar to triangle C, D, P from angle, angle criteria. So when these two triangles are similar, we can write their corresponding sides will be in the same ratio. So we will write AB divided by CD is equal to BP divided by DP is equal to AP divided by CP. So first of all, will take uh, AB by CD is equal to BP by DP. Okay. So when we take the first one. So AB is 6 by CD. The length of CD we don't know. So BP is 15 by DP which again we don't know. That is equal to AP which is 12 and CP which is 4. So this is 3. So first we will take first and last. Okay, so from here, first we'll take this one and this one. So it says 6 by CD is equal to 3. So from here, CD is equal to 6 by 3, which is 2. Okay, next we'll take the second one and the third equation. So it says 15 by DP is equal to 3. So the value of DP is 15 by 3, which is 5. So, the answers are the length of PD is 5 cm and the length of CD is 2 cm. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.